Hello guys. In this video I will show you how to make this typewriter effect in the Adobe Premiere Pro. This video is sponsored by Wondershare VidAir. Have no ideas to promote your business or channel? Try video marketing now. VidAir provides creative templates and asks for no script even. Create stunning videos with abundant free videos, images, and music. Or upload local resources. And here you'll get some attractive video templates, with different categories. And it's pretty easy to customize. Expand your brand with Wondershare VidAir. So now we are in Adobe Premiere Pro. Already I've imported a background image, and the writing sound effects. You can get it under the description link. So first move the time indicator to the first frame. Then select the type tool. And type your text line in the program window. Then open the essential graphics tab to edit this title. Under the essential graphics tab, click on edit. Then mark all the text lines. And here I am using the special elite font. Also, I am increasing the font size around 200. Then using the align tool to make it center. Now move over to the effects control tab. Then click on the text drop down icon. And make a keyframe on the source text. Now mark and remove all the text lines. Then move the time indicator at the beginning of the first writing sound. And type your first letter. Again move the time indicator to the second sound effects. And type your second letter. And keep doing this until your writing is finished. Okay, now let's see a quick preview. And already it looks very cool. Now let's see how to add the typing line effect. So move over to the project panel and make a black video. Click on this new item icon and select the black video, then click on OK. Now drag and drop the black video above the graphic layer. Now select the black video layer. Then go to the effect controls tab and uncheck the uniform scale and set the scale width 0.3. Then down the scale height, just slightly bigger than my text. Now change the position to the beginning of the text. And move the time indicator to the first writing sound effect. Then make a keyframe on the position. Again move the time indicator to the second keyframe. And change the line position to the second letter. And do it continue until the last letter. Okay, let's see the preview. Now let's add the flicker effect to the line. So move the time indicator to the first frame. And make sure the black video is selected. Then click on the opacity drop down icon. And make a keyframe on the opacity. Then move 5 frames to the right side. So click on the right arrow key 5 times. And change the opacity 0. Then again move 5 frames to the right and change the opacity to 100%. Now just mark all the opacity keyframes, click Ctrl plus C to copy, and click Ctrl plus V to paste. Again mark all the keyframes, copy and paste them to the last keyframe. And do it continue. Okay, we have done the animation. Let's see the final preview. Thanks for watching, if you enjoy this animation, please give a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe. If you have any questions, please feel free to ask me on Instagram. I'll see you in the next one, have a nice day.